bad songs existed before computers ruined music. Welcome back to a series where you guys pick a year and I select a terrible song. To show music fans that say that new music just doesn't hold up, that there was plenty of terrible music way before auto-tune ruined everything. You guys have been so great with providing suggestions and your pick for this video is 1985. The best-selling single of 1985 was of course Careless Whisper by Wham, and arguably a timeless classic. My pick for the worst hit of 1985 does not hold that distinction. Peaking at number nine on the Billboard Hot 100, this song is written by an artist that's already been mentioned in this series. Given to one of his protégés to dirty up her squeaky clean image, it just sounds like a demo that wasn't quite ready for release. My pick for 1985 is Sugar Walls by Sheena Easton, of course, written by Prince. This song is a mess on a bunch of different levels. It's got clashing instrumental parts that kind of feel like they're falling on top of each other, a super strange vocal melody, and super cringy, overtly sexual lyrics. Those lyrics, in fact, put this song on the Filthy 15 list made by the Parents Music Resource Center, or PMRC, run by the wife of the creator of the internet, Tipper Gore. And to be perfectly honest, the controversy around this song is the most interesting thing about it. If you enjoyed this form, Format, leave a year in the comments and I will cover more terrible chart toppers as a way to prove that 